The electrical system is located in the power control center inside your trailer. The door panel will pop out and you will see that all your fuses are located here. The 120 volt breakers are on the left and the 12 volt fuses are on the right. The 120 volt system works exactly like the 120 volt system in your home and depending on your options your breakers will vary. These must be turned on for the various systems to operate. When your scamp is plugged in at the campground, the power converter behind this panel will automatically allow your 12 volt appliances to operate without using your battery. This might include your TV, radio, or lights. So as long as you're plugged in to a power source, there's no worries that your trailer battery will become dead. If you ever need to change a 12 volt fuse, simply grab it and pull it straight out. Then replace it with a new fuse. If your scamp is equipped with a TV package, there are three things you will have. A TV, an antenna, and a remote. To operate, you must turn on the main power to the TV antenna. This is located next to the TV and it must be turned on to power the TV antenna. The TV must also be connected with the nearby 12 volt power plug. You should unplug the TV when it is not in use to make sure that it is not drawing any power. Then you turn on your antenna power button. The red power button will light up. Turn the large knob to change the direction of the antenna. There's a little button on the side that must be pushed to move the antenna. Then you can adjust the signal strength with the attenuator. The more signal strength lights that illuminate as you turn it, the more stable your picture will be. You can use the remote to turn on the TV. To find channels in your area, press the menu button on the remote. Then scroll over to the channel icon on the far right. On the drop down menu, make sure you are on air and not the cable setting. You can then drop down one more to channel search and hit enter. It will automatically search for stations. Just note that this could take several minutes to program stations, so be patient.